The Newman Lab was built right after the Second World War, and this was when people like Hans Bethe came back from working on the Manhattan Project, and, and he brought back a lot of other talent also, and they really started a program of um, particle physics and accelerators here. This is the nexus of particle accelerators. The Laboratory for Nuclear Science first began at Cornell. This is where it all started. As you look at Newman Lab, there's really unique infrastructure there. Things that enable research that could be done only at one or two other places in the country. And so we are at the forefront of developing things like the superconducting cavity. There is a constant kind of evolution in the capabilities of these detectors that are necessary for us to explore the, the physics of the future. So today, we now use some of that infrastructure for other purposes. And uh, that includes uh, building new photocathodes, which is basically new electron sources that are capable of things that were never possible before, uh, imaging certain structures, learning about how they behave. Building telescopes for cosmology, as well as building very high efficiency accelerating structures for the next big thing in accelerator physics. What we do is very much diverse, but going from really fundamental physics, even theoretical physics, to very much hands-on engineering work. So it's great for incoming students from even different fields to get started in research, because you can have projects which are suitable for an undergrad with some limited experience, but it's still part of our main mission. So what we're doing, what they're doing, is actually important to us. We've partnered with a number of material science faculty members across campus. Surface chemistry, condensed matter physics, both theory and experiment, to help us design emitters of electrons that produce denser beams and colder beams, beams that are more coherent. I really look forward to this cooperative approach to doing science. I think it's incredibly powerful and also the direction that science needs to go. Cornell has really had a, a long successful program in uh, accelerator physics and particle physics. Cornell and, and particularly Newman Lab with its unique capabilities is in a position to really seize opportunities wherever they come and so we're always keeping our eye on the future.